Hello, hello, it is me. Oof, I feel kind of far. Hello, hello, it is me. Game Raiders 103. Don't ask what happened to 102. So, we're here back in Nunderson, back in our regular resolution. I switched my monitor back. So now I got this like $300 uh, 21 by 9 widescreen monitor just as my second monitor. That's great. It's good, good use. It was too much work for... Uh, for me to record with it that's pretty much why i stopped using it for my main monitor i liked it a lot though and i already missed it because i feel like this monitor that i'm using let me whip out the ruler i don't even know how big this monitor i think it's 24 inch 24 inch let's see here we got about 12 it's about tw it's about 24 it's about tw what the fuck was that i'll figure out something to do with this maybe i'll sell it i don't know probably not though i'll probably keep it and use it for porn okay so we're gonna be doing some things today now there is abyssion the phantom and the abomination and then everything else i think what we're gonna do is phantom and abomination i think that's what we're gonna do so let's do it paladin emblem i need to look up like next next set of weapons that's what i need to do what am i doing i'm hitting every button i forgot how to play the game all right, hold up. I need to. Let's see here. Let's reforge. Yeah, let's do that. Let's reforge, 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 reforge. Let's do that first. Get some good on this. Demonic. Yeah, whatever. And then we'll do uh, glyphs. That's how you do it. Reforging glyphs. Um, I'm gonna put the life steal. Honestly, I think I should just put the life steal glyph on everything. Cause that's really smart. So, uh, I might do that, honestly. There you go. Fuck it, we're doing it. <laughs> might as well. I don't see no reason not to. I wanted to have... No, fuck it. I don't, I don't really give a shit. I think actually having it on this. That's what we're gonna do. For my, my big three right here. Those are my... This is my new... This is my new big three. These three. Why'd I put Agile on that? I don't, I don't know why I didn't just get damaged. All right, so uh, give me a second. I'm going to hit up some wikis and see what throwing weapon I can get right now if anything's good. All right, so there's only one weapon that I saw. I kind of don't even want it. So I'm not even going to touch it. I'll tell you what it is, though. I will tell you. It's called the Soul Slasher. Nothing nothing special. A lot of decent damage. Maybe I'll get it. Maybe I won't. But I got I got better things to do. Or not better things to do. I got a better idea about what we can make. And it just hit me. Boom. Volume 2. Guide. Volume 2. No, we got to pick up Volume 3. We got to head to the desert for that. We're finally going to upgrade our books here. Uh, been a long time coming. Yeah, we need to go all the way to the desert. Where's my mount? Oh, the helicopter. I forgot. How beautiful. Let, let me make some noise. A helicopter. My lips are dry. All right, there you go. Hopefully that doesn't sound bad on the mic. I have a pop filter though, so it shouldn't. All right, there you go. So let's go through all of them here. The first one, one fifth damage duplicated for one fifth. Uh, there's not being duplicated. There's it being duplicated. You'll see a little number in there every now and then. The second one is one fourth. So that did like 80, 90. Uh, we'll put it on now. It should do a hundred. Yeah, you see there's a couple of hundreds in there. And then this one is one third. So let's see what it ups. So like mid one hundreds. So if we take all these and put them together, what beauty will they make? What's the name of the actual thing? Complete set. Okay. Complete set. Ooh, did I spell that wrong? The complete set. I need an ancient matter manipulator. All right, you know what? We're doing it. We're finding the lunatic cultist. I think we're going to change up how we do this episode then. Yeah, we're going to change up the whole entire episode. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. I was going to do... I was going to do a phantom abomination, but instead we're going to do abyssion, cultist, and probably kill the pillars and do a reset, a pillar reset. So let's do that. Hold up. Autismo is here. He'll, he'll protect me. Yeah, that's all I need, honestly. Okay. Let's zoom out all the way buff up and let's get to it 
Don't don't even think about it. That boy, that boy tried to shoot me with that arrow. Mm, ain't happening. All right, let's do it. This is my arena. This is a bad arena. That's all we need in life. Bad, bad bitches and bad arenas. <laughs> hey, chill out. We're gonna use this. I don't know how good this is. It makes the same noise as he does. That bothers me. That bothers me a good bit. All right, we're gonna throw pumpkins at him now. Wait. Okay, I hit the right one. All right, we're good. We're good. No, we're not. Okay, no, this is good. We're good. Just do this. Oh my god, you know, I miss having uh, triple accessories, man. That was such a luxury to have. Where's he at? That was such a luxury to have, and now we got a. Uh, we got the. I didn't even. Oh, because we don't even have the accessory. Fuck, I hit the wrong one. I think I did that twice now. <laughs> ah! Chill out. We need to drink that so we're good on health. You guys might have heard my phone. I don't know. My phone is really far away from me. I can't see it. No, I can see it. I can't hear it. I can see that I got a text message. All right, there you go. Who the hell are you? Hey, don't kill him. Oh, fuck. Now we got to fight a pillar. Now we got to fight a pillar. Hey, don't die. I want to I wanna see if you sell any throwing weapons, man. Stay alive, okay? <laughs> we got to do a quick, a quick uh, little invasion right here. We good? Can I protect this guy real quick? Oh my god, look how much loot we have. They finally added in uh, an action figure for him. That's nice. That's nice to see. Alright, you know what? Toss out some pumpkins. Get these guys to start auto-killing. auto kill. I guess. I don't know. I feel like I've never heard anybody say auto-killing. We're gonna get this. I'm making it. I'm making a new phrase. Auto-kill. You should just shoot out a bunch of homing pumpkins. And they'll go do all the work for you. Alright, so while we got... Oh my god, he died! Heretic! Oh, I get it like heretic, like heretic. I don't know, I'm just making things up. Alright, we should be able to kill the pillar in a second here. Don't touch me. Alright, where is it? All the way up here? God damn. Why are you all the way up here? Why do I have this? When will I ever use this effectively? I don't know. Damn, that, we just saw that, that alien grow up before our eyes. How, what a beautiful... Life is beautiful. Awesome. All right. I don't know how much I'll show of all of these pillars. Probably a decent bit. But uh, there you go. Completed. This is so bad. It's so bad, dude. What the fuck? All right. I guess we're doing another one. I didn't think there'd be one here. Honestly. But it's, all, it's fine. It's the star cell one. This one's not that bad at all. I think like this one and the, the one I just did are some of the easiest. I feel like the so solar one is pretty hard, and the nebula one. Just because the nebula one got like doesn't got like teleporting enemies. I don't know. Definitely the solar one is hard. But uh, so we'll just you know we'll stop shooting me. All right. I don't think there's any throwing weapons. We don't have that um. What was that pillar items plus? That name of the mod. We don't have that mod in here. Should I just let... Honestly, I think I should let the star cells grow up. They become, not grow up. I don't, I don't feel like star cells... No, they might grow up. But if we let them... If we kill like half of them and then let them grow up... We could probably like... So I use that to our advantage. We just keep on spawning in. Big enough enemies to count towards the pillar itself. There's like two... There's like three different worms in this. Am I tripping? I ain't gonna touch them anymore. Ow, bitch. That hurts. Boom. Hit him with the shuriken. The big one. We just killed another vanilla boss, so we should be stronger. Like, we should be doing some crazy damage. Alright. We're gonna we're gonna do some of this. Some pump, pumpkining. -ing. I feel like the pillar should hurt you if you go near. Go near. Um, we're gonna do some pump, pumpkining. -ing. And we'll see if that helps a lot. Honestly, I don't like this weapon at all. I feel like it does, like, no damage. It just like it's an intimidating weapon. It looks like it does damage. But look, what the fuck? I have way better weapons. I have, I have homing pumpkins. I have very very strong spears that hit for like 700 each. Um, there's no point in me using this. So we're probably gonna get rid of this like right away as soon as we find a better fill filler weapon. But uh, I'll cut to when we're at the end of this pillar. Pillar's about to open up. Go ahead, send in the homing pumpkins. Alright. You know what? Let's use the brackish flask. 
That might be pretty damn good to use against these. Yeah, it's pretty damn good. Man. The Brackish Flash is... Fla oh my god, I have so much trouble. Brackish Flask. I say bl Brackish Flashkish. Um, it's pretty good. And I really should like use it a lot more. Honestly. That should be the go-to. Yeah, we're switching that. I should get lifesteal on that too. Okay, so let's peep. No one died, thank god. Let's peep, but not little peep. I don't want to die. <laughs> okay, um. The ancient, that doesn't have any. Okay, half of those don't have anything for me to use it. Don't have a use for me. I don't know what I'm trying to say. That's a ranged weapon. We're going to sell it. Um. So let's pull up the recipe browser. Let's see here. We got a solar emblem. I mean, assuming it drops from the lunatic cultist. So let's see here. Let's take it's not the celestial. Are we gonna need this at all? I don't think this does anything at all for us. We got quasar fragment. Quasar. 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 Fuck! I remember I looked this up. How to say it? Quas. We're gonna say quasar. Quas. Hold up. Quasar. I know how to say it. All right, let's see what we can make here. There's wings. Oh, we need luminite, so we can't really make much. It looks really cool. It's a throwing set. Oblivion Forge. Okay. Now, the question is, was this added in because I started doing a play th throwing playthrough, or was this added in before? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Only one man can answer that. Maybe you guys can answer it. Cultist Leader. I'll buy that. What else did I get? All right, let's see. This is the truth right here. Is there any throwing weapons that I'm going to be able to make out of these fragments? I, I'm sorry. I hit my mic. Um, I don't see anything. I see a fucking box. There's that right there. Vortex Slasher. Spear mod. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. But you know what I actually want to make? I want to make this bad boy right here. Corrosive Flask. There's a reason why I was saving this. The Toxic Flask. Saving this like I'm looking at. Oh, Juice also adds in a bunch of stuff. Alright, sweet. So we should be good then. How do we make these? And do these require Luminite? Oh my god, all throwing armor requires Luminite, man. This is the armor we're rocking until post Moon Lord. Okay, what do I combine this with? Crucible of the Cosmos? I can probably make that. But then like, Dreadon's Forge. No, we don't have to worry about Dreadon's Forge. Like, look, like what the fuck? Superb crafting compound. No, it just says pound. <laughs> I'm trying to pound. All right, now we can make the book, the complete set. There we go. Boom. Bada bing. All right, so uh, let's reforge. Where are you at, my boy? My boy Fiel. It's like I fell down the stairs. Oh, that was easy. Uh, sh bye bye. Warding talisman. Raiders talisman. I will miss you. Okay. So there's that. Now our damage should be crazy. What is this passive? Throwing damage duplicate itself for one half of the damage. Oh my. I don't know. I can't tell if I'm doing a lot more. Oh my god, that big shuriken does not play around, dude. <laughs> oh my. That's like a gunshot. Alright, so. Moving on here. We are going to fight. We got two more pillars. And then we also do pillar reset. Do I really want to go to the depths and fight something there? This episode? I don't know, guys. I don't know if I want to. I'm not feeling the aquatic depths right now. I don't feel like getting wet. Pause on that. Uh, I don't know. Do I have to say pause on that? Oh, look. Heat distortion. Ah, I can't see. All right. I say heat distortion because you can see like the heat wave now. I turned that back on. I don't know why I had that off. I also turned my graphics back to auto. I don't know if I put a high or auto. I had it on low. I don't know why. My computer is more than a capable to run it. At least I hope. I have a really good computer and I feel like I can't run a lot of things. And I was asking my boy about it. Jirachi. I was like, what? If I were to upgrade my computer, what can I run next? He's like, what do you mean? Your computer have a problem running things? And I was like, oh yeah, OBS has trouble running Fortnite. That might just be like a something between those two just don't like each other. And then I was like, oh yeah, um, what's that other game? Kingdom Come Deliverance. I'm not able to record it and uh, play it at the same time. 
it's like and he just said like oh those games all are buggy and stuff like that it's like no there's something to it man something about my computer ain't up to par and i don't know what it is i'm very bothered that i don't know what it is it might be i doubt more ram is needed dude we're about to fucking die these enemies hurt what i tell you guys nebula pillar is not playing around same thing with the solar one solar one might actually be easier than nebula nebula got them shots on your body all right so i'll probably upgrade it like i just got a 1070 recently like do i need to get a new processor or something i'm pretty sure i have an i7 i don't remember my exact specs i'll look into it <laughs> I'll look at my history of what I bought for computer parts. But uh, I feel like my computer should be able to run like a lot of things no problem and be able to record them no problem. But it just doesn't feel like I'm getting that. Feels like I'm not getting that respect for my computer after all the respect, uh, parentheses, money. That's what respect for my computer, that's all the respect I put into it, my hard earned cash. So like. It's not like the computer's giving me head, at least give me like good give me good something for all that money I use, right? But we'll see. We'll see in the future. I need to do something about my internet too. I chose like the best plan. The best like upload speed and download speed on Comcast or the Xfinity. And it's not it's not showing out, man. It's not showing out. I don't know what's up. It ain't giving me the respect, aka the money, motherfucker. We're almost done. I'm coming for you, pillar. I'm coming for you. You disrespect me like my computer and Comcast. No, that's the wrong item. Kill it. Kill it quick. Don't touch me. I haven't been touched yet. I feel like I'm doing a no damage playthrough. No damage playthrough. Don't touch me now. Hey, hey the damage is allowed now because I beat the boss. No damage boss run. That's the title. I'm lying. Alright, um, there you go. Get out of here. There we go. We got all of it. Nice. Next pillar. On to the next. How you gnomes doing? I, that just reminded me. I better play some gnomes at the end of this episode. Alright, we're gonna do my favorite pillar. The Sola pillar. Sola. Alright, let's do it. Oh my fuck, I'm already hurt. Do I have anything that homes besides this? I think it's really all I have that homes. It's fine. We'll use it. We'll use it to the best of our advantage here. I don't I don't like this pillar, man. I don't like this pillar. <laughs> a lot of a lot of heavy damage dealers here because it's the melee pillar. Holy shit. I think I died to my own pumpkin. Now I've been playing Terraria for a long time. It's always nice when you, you figure out you see something new or learn something new. Don't stand next to your own pumpkin. Stop! Stop! Alright. We're just gonna we're just gonna use Nunderson's glove for the rest of this, honestly. Actually, this might be good too, because it, this has got a little bit of homing homing in it too. Now just throw them up in the air, maybe they'll come back down. I don't know. These things these things shoot really straight, so I don't know if they'll What the fuck? Do they have reflection? I didn't know that. You know, I've been playing Terraria for a long time, and it's always nice when you learn something new. Like one of these enemies has something that reflects my attacks. I didn't know that. Was I supposed to know? Like, what do I do to counter it? Not attack? I can't just do that. I can't just do that. It's like people telling me to, like, just, like, dodge. What was that one shit people said? I don't remember. It was like a boss that people were just, like, just dodge it. It's like, alright, I'll do my best. Uh, I don't know what enemy's been doing it. I'm very scared now to attack. Very hesitant. It looked like the humanoid ones. That guy right there. That dude looked like he'd kill me. Alright, see, this is not that bad anymore. Like, am I not close to the pillar? I'll get closer. Then. Look, I'm like right next to that bitch. Ah! Okay, that's why I get for going right next to it. What the fuck, dude? What is this? There's like millions of enemies, and now there's like a handful. Alright. There we go, there we go. Enemies coming back. They're coming back strong. They're coming back strong. But yeah, back to what I was talking about. A little bit earlier i pay so much for my fucking i pay a hundred dollars a month for my internet like a hundred might be 108 i don't know whatever but that's besides the point the exact number but a hundred dollars is a lot for internet and i still have trouble streaming dude i still get encoding errors i still get fucking red 
red squares. If you use OBS, you know what I'm talking about. Well, if you ever have problems like with your internet, you get like those red squares, yellow squares in the bottom right corner of OBS. That means like, oh, like it ain't going too hot. Your streaming ain't going too hot. Like there's a little bit of lag popping off. It's like, what the fuck, dude? I put all this money in. A hundred may not sound like a lot, but for the internet I'm paying for, it, that's oh my fucking god. Is that when you're not supposed to attack them? But yeah, um, it's like, come on. Dude. I don't remember the exact numbers, but it's, it's supposed to be really fucking good. And it doesn't feel really fucking good. That's like with a lot of things. Like, I feel like I'm being, I'm being ripped off here and there from things. Uh, I do have, it just came with it, but I pay for it and it's kind of annoying. It came with the... TV stuff like a modem box not modem box cable box what the fuck are they called uh it came with that I didn't want it and I just kind of I just gave it to my mom <laughs> but she doesn't even use it and then my brother eventually bought her Chromecast for her birthday and it's like god damn what the hell am I supposed to do there so I just have that laying around I don't watch TV I don't watch TV like I watch I watch shit on the internet because like oh my fucking god guys I'm gonna go and say I watch stuff on the internet that's just how I am born and raised like that but like nah, I watched a lot of TV when I was younger but it's like come on what did you guys have any solutions for that I don't know I bet half you guys don't care because probably you guys are too young to care then again I just want good internet <laughs> I just want good internet. Xfinity may be the problem. I don't even know what contract I'm signed with them. I think the original like bundle I paid for was only a year or two years long. And then now, cause I used to pay only 74, like 75. That wasn't bad, that's fine. Uh, for the quality it is. Oh my God, please don't do that ever again. That shit hurt it, dude. But uh, you know, eat my ass. All right, died like four times in a row, five times in a row to the same thing, killing myself apparently. Uh, but the pillar is almost done. And in that last clip, I meant to say lick ass because it's 2018 and we changing things up, right? Let's just get to the pillar as fast as we can. Come on, we're gonna kill everything. Let's go. Just go ahead. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead, dude. Kill it before you get killed by yourself again. Just everyone back away now. Like, just don't, don't even come near me. Yeah, good for impending doom. Am I right? All right, we're gonna suck everything in. And we're gonna run for our lives. Oh, we're gonna do what's that slug eyes that looks pretty cool all right we're gonna we're gonna get out of here fuck the moon lord we're gonna hop back in nunderson lobbing lands all right let's peep it now let's peep all the goodies we got that stuff that's what we got okay just honestly we're just gonna stuff it in slug eyes i can't wait to use these accessories in the next playthrough it, it seems so like fitting too, like bugs, bug accessories. We're playing a dude that uses bugs as bait, you know, cause he's a fisherman. All right, so let's get rid of this. We're gonna get rid of both of these. And we're gonna, we're gonna get that flask in here. We're gonna get that flask in here, corrosive flask. Yes, there it is, boom. I'm hyped for this. Let's get ward, or not warding. This ain't an accessory, let's get some on it. Superior? Nah, we can do more. We can do more than that. We can do way better. It's only three gold a thing, too. Hurtful might be the way to go, actually. Superior? Alright. Superior is 10%. I don't care about... Oh, demonic. There we go. That's more like it. Demonic. Oh, 458? Oh, my. Holy shit. Did you guys hear that? <laughs> That was like one flash. Holy fuck. This is gonna be amazing, dude. This is gonna be amazing. Cough up the glyphs. Cough up the glyphs. This thing better one shot something. Uh, you, Monique. Just give me all sanguine. All sanguine everything. Sorry if you hear my phone again. And then this. Okay. Boom. It's popping off. It's popping off, guys. 
this is about to be crazy. I'm having some troubles here. If you can, if you, if you see me, I'm, I was having a little bit of troubles there. Um, actually, no, nah, keep the ninja rack up there. Might as well. Let's move this to the left side. I feel like that's going to bother me putting that over there. All right, let's do that instead. There you go. And, uh, while I'm here, do I have any campfires? We're going to make a campfire. Then. So we're about to end off the episode. Play some gnomes. We're going to fight a boss, obviously. Uh, oh, I forgot to upgrade that. Let's, uh, let's buff up, too. Let's buff up with this. You know, be the strongest we can. I don't know what boss we're going to fight, but we're going to fight it real good. Atlas. Perfect boss. I like Atlas. I like Atlas for testing because, like, he's a nice, simple boss. Nice, easy, simple boss. All right, here it goes. You're going to get shit thrown at you, Atlas. I hope you don't mind. Okay, it's not as crazy. Probably because bosses don't stand still. A lot of particle effects. I'm down to 40, 50 frames instead of 60. That's fine. But uh, that was like not bad at all. That was not bad at all. Only like a handful of flat. Imagine throwing three of them. Oh my god, it would be so strong. Like, I don't know why it does that. <laughs> pretty insane that it does that all right we're gonna try it on a, on a more like harder boss more harder on a more tough boss from calamity abomination actually what's his name probably would have been a better test because i could have just did him over there ravager we're just no we're gonna end the episode off over here too after we kill this boss we're gonna place the gnomes over here because i don't know how many gnome camps i have in this direction i think maybe one that one right there that's about it all right let's zoom out let's see how it is against a bomb oh my god he already like fucking took a bite out of my health bar hopefully he's not that loud i think it's because bosses don't particularly stand still oh he's standing still he's taking some hits though the particle effects on this is insane dude. but they might need to lower that a little bit if my rig is having troubles running this, think of like lower, more low end rigs. But this is what I was talking about, about my computer not being able to run things. Like, how am I not able to run this? It's Terraria. Come on, man. I bet if I had a 1080, I still couldn't run this. All right, that was so easy. That was so fucking easy. Was that with buffs? That's about all, the side of hand buff. And I guess this well-fed life force. I don't actually know what the hell is giving me life force, but Oh, does this give me plus two life regen? Per oh, never mind. I know why. It's because I have the reforge on it. Put my celestial powers. All right. But yeah, that was really good. That guy's sinking down into the underground. We're going to head deep into the jungle and place a gnome camp. And uh, we're going to end off after that. Deep into the jungle right here. This is deep enough. No, we'll actually go pretty, pretty deep. Eh, not pretty deep. Kind of deep. Right here. This is perfect. This is perfect. Boom, boom. Just a nice... That's like the most simple gnome camp we've had. I want to try something real quick. How fast is this? It's not that fast. I think the pick saw is faster. It just has... This just has a range on it. This is, That's probably my favorite thing was like using it as a weapon. Was using it as a weapon. When the hell did I ever use it as a weapon in the past? All right. Yeah, that's going to end off this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Nunderson Resolution is back. Fuck my internet. Fuck my computer. Fuck me, please.